Hello, and welcome to another episode of Armor Special. There have been many big and famous franchises LEGO has wanted to make money on. Most of them became a success, some of them failed, and some of LEGO's own themes they really want you to forget. Here are top 5 forgotten LEGO themes. On 5th place we have James Bond. And in case you don't know what it is, James Bond is a very big movie franchise. Did you know there are 24 James Bond movies, and they're all about this guy, right here. In the early 2000s, LEGO decided to make James Bond sets. The sets are pretty full of details, which I think is good, and I also like the prints on all the minifigures. But one bad thing is the face on James Bond. They could made it a little bit better at least, but yeah. Number four, Jack Stone. Yes, this was a theme. And you know what? They even made a toothbrush. Why? Toothbrush! This dude looks dead. The figures in this theme are very ugly, but I actually like the design of the helicopters. And here's another good looking helicopter, but the cars in this theme do not look so good. Lego, you could have done this better. On third place we have Avatar The Last Airbender. The minifigures in this theme are actually pretty cool, but there were only Two sets ever released. You're gonna pay for this Lego? Uh, you okay, mate? Lego released Avatar and Spongebob at the same time, but they decided to discontinue with Avatar and continue with Spongebob. And number two is Little Robots. This was a kid show on BBC and Lego wanted to make a theme of it. And I'm gonna be honest now, these figures are not cute. Seriously, they are pretty creepy. Number one, Scala. Okay, Lego, this doesn't even look like Lego. It's too much dolly style, if you can say it like that. And I think many of the set it is like, it's a messy room or something like that, and the doll imagine it to be pretty. And you're supposed to build it up pretty again. Because it shows that on a picture. And Lego has made a pretty big mistake here because it doesn't even look like Lego. So, this was the Iron Special, and I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. And I spent so much time on this Iron Special, so please subscribe, or as I said before, give it a thumbs up. See you next time.